So how much talk more do we do? With a fight. We just knocked that Pteranodon the hell out. Damn. What's going on guys, and welcome back to another episode of Ark the Center. Last we left off, we tamed this Gigantoraptor here. It was only a level 85, but it was better than something, better than nothing. Because these guys were very hard to find. I had a hard time finding them, they were kind of rare. I only found like one other, it was like a 95 or something. But yeah, in today's video, I would like to take a trip over to the Redwoods, because while taking the Gigantoraptor home, I ran into a couple of drops, and one of them had a tree platform. Yeah, we got a tree platform and a tree sap tap on there, and I want to get the sap tap for the, for the you know, the sap or whatever, so we could start making sweet veggie cakes and whatever. All right, let me just put on my regular outfit for like right now. But yeah, we're gonna take a trip over to the Redwoods and we're gonna see what goes on there. Because another thing on the agenda, I would like to try and tame the, um, what you call it? The Civitherium, I think it's called. Basically, there it is. Civitherium Saddle. Basically, this guy is like, um, like a, a walking spyglass. It's got a spyglass mod, and it basically tells you how many points a creature has into a certain stat. So, we there's a possibility that we can use this to find high-level Rexes. Maybe try to find a Rex with better stats and whatever than the ones we've got in there. Yeah, we could try to do that. So I should have everything ready. I think Mufasa, you're gonna... All right, we've got some cooked meat. You know, we don't need all this meat. I'm just gonna drop whatever I can. All right, so I'm thinking we take the Dinosuchus because it's really good at swimming, and it's like, you know. And once we get there, of course we'll use the the Pyromane. I kinda wanna get some kibble just in case we find ourselves a one of those Australian sauropod things. The Diamantinosaur, I believe it's called. Let me just see. Uh, we'll bring like 20 kibble, just in case. Alright. So what I kind of want to do, we'll bring the D-Arc. We'll bring the D-Arc so we can fly around, you know. And then off camera, I'll probably find like a... I'll probably build like a different way up to the tree platform because, you know, I kind of want to, you know, have access even if I don't have a flyer. All right, so let's take the Dinosuchus out. You can go for a little swim, and then from there, once we leave, once we get on land, we'll switch over to the Pyromane and see what we want to do with this tree platform, which tree I want to use. I think I want to use the one straight ahead. Just that way there, we can just go straight ahead. And then, boom, the tree platform's there. Alright, one of these trees, I'm thinking. Yeah, that's the first thing I want to do. The second thing I want to do, see if I can find a Civitherium. Because they typically like to spawn in the Redwoods. So, And the good thing about them is you can ride them and nothing aggros to you. That's one of the good things about that, too. So, we'll head over to the Redwoods. I'm thinking that tree there. And then on my spare time, I'll make like a, a compost, or not a compost, like a compound. That could be my compound area. I still want to build a base in the in the air bubble. I still want to build a base there. I mean, I haven't really gotten around to it. We gotta make, I'd love to tame as a fact in this. I would love to tame one of those. All right, that's a level 50 Megalodon that just died. I never really, I think the last time I've been to the Redwoods was when we tamed a Monolophosaurus. There's one right there, a 95. I don't have the proper resources to tame one at the moment. I mean, if we do find one, if we can find like a baby or something, then we'll tame it. 
All right. First things first, let me figure out what tree I want to use. I'm thinking this one straight ahead. Yeah, there we go. We'll put the tree platform, like, up here somewhere. All right. Dinosuchus, great job, buddy. I'm going to put you away. And then I'm going to take the D-Arc out. And we're going to fly over to the tree platform. Now, would this be too high up? No, I think this is high enough. High enough. Alright, I want to put the tree sap tap down. These we got from drops. There we go. So now we should get some sap. And then off camera, I'll like find a put away make a way up there. I'll I'll probably build like a a camp downstairs. And then we'll like get like a a stairwell that that leads up here. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Alright, D Ark. Great job. So now this is where the pyromane comes in. And now we're just going to ride around looking for a civetherium. Actually, you know what I forgot to bring? Crops. Because I... To my knowledge, I think they only take sweet veggie cakes. Or like veggies. And I think I forgot to bring veggies. So if we find a civetherium, we'll see if they take the kibble. If not... Then we'll, we can always go back to base and get the, the veggies. I've got plenty of those. Are we going to Microraptor? Ha ha ha! Screw you, Microraptor. I don't know if these guys take kibble or not. I heard they don't. But we'll try it. And if they don't take kibble, then we can always go back. That's a level 20 Dire Bear. I don't know if I'm looking for a dire bear or not, and a deer with a monolophosaurus. That's a 130 female mono. Alright, Microraptor. Alright, can you not be... I want you to be neutral. Uh, can you fight this Microraptor, please? Thank you. I mean, if we can find some mono bile, if we can get an alpha mono and kill it for bile... I saw that Microraptor. Alright, just ignore it. Ignore it, and maybe it will go away. Oh, this is just wonderful. Ooh, okay. Alright, I think we got away from the Microraptor. That's good. Damn it, we still landed in the water. That kind of sucks. I didn't want to land in the water, but whatever. Hello, Diplo. 95. I barely see anything. I'm still looking for, a, like, a baby Trudon. If we could find some baby Trudons, I could tame them. It's just so we have Trudons. They'd be more like prized possessions and whatever. I also want to tame one of those spider things. Oh, we got ants after us. Still landed in the water. That's a level 100. We could definitely do better than that. I think we need to, like, build the shield and whatever. And I think we need, like, mashed... Whatever. Mashed... Yeah, I think it's mashed insects for the spider thing. And then mashed bugs is how you tame one of those gecko things. Mashed insects doesn't seem too hard. Rare flowers, chitin, medjo berries, and raw meat. And then you need, like, the special type of shield. Oh, what's this? Me Melania skull shield. Hmm. Let me see. All right, it's the iridescent chitin. You need iridescent... Oh, get out of here, you. You need iridescent chitin, which is what those spiders drop. I think I lost the chitin that I had when that epic crash hit. You know? So, I don't think we have that at the moment. Let's keep looking in the redwoods, see if we can find anything. Oh, hello, monos. That's a max level mono. Max level male with a 50 spider. A 140 with a max level. If we can get some bile, then we could possibly try and find them. Hmm. They're around here. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna mark it down on the map. Alright. I have it marked on the map, so I'll have a, a game. Game. Thank you. I'll mark it out on the maps to see if we can try to find it anyway. 
So at least we know it's in the general area. But as long as we stay at a render distance, we should be fine. Well, hello. Level 60 Australian sauropod. These guys, you gotta wait for them to... Oh, yeah, I saw that Microraptor. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. I jump off so then they don't have the satisfaction of throwing me off. Oh, hello. That's a max level female spider. Ooh. You know what? And it's a female too. You have to tame the female to tame the... Let me... Okay, Terror Bird, piss off. Alright, let me mark it down on the, uh, on the map as well. Just so we know. Alright, if we just leave render distance, we should be fine. Alright, Rock, get out of the way. We gotta shoot on with a baby. It's a 130. Ants piss off. Archipago, don't. Please don't. That is a beautiful Troodon. Shame you're only a level 15. I want to. Ouch. Did I kill the baby by accident? You know, this is where the Gigantoraptor would have came in handy. Because he could have searched out the baby Trudon. And then we could have tamed it. But whatever. Whatever, you know. It's not the end of the world. I'm not in a rush to tame a Trudon, but... Yeah. I mean, if there's like an easier way, then I'll utilize it. If we don't find any sieves... We can try to tame that max level spider. Yeah, as long as we have a general idea on where it is, it could be good. Got a couple. Ow! Terror Bird, piss off. Pego, I don't have time for you right now. I don't know what that galley's running from, but I really don't care. There's another one of those Diamantinosaurs. That's a 20. For those guys, I'd like a relatively high level, like a 130 or something. I'll continue the search for a little bit. That's a 140 female. Mono. Yeah, get rid of that Microraptor. Of course you've got friends! The last few Microraptors have been by themselves. Now, now all of a sudden you guys have friends? Of course, you fly away as soon as I get on you. Alright, there we go. Alright, I think... Of course, there's another one! As I was about to say, there was the last of them. There's one more. Alright, anyone else? Alright, let's continue our search. Yeah, I'm not really seeing any Civetheriums. I mean, I'm not in a rush to tame one. I just, I would, it would just be nice to have that spyglass feature. But, we've got a spy... Uh, what the hell happened to my arrows? Did I... Oh, they're in your inventory. A Pego must have stole my arrows at one point. Good job you got them back, Mufasa. Otherwise, we would have been in real trouble. What if I found, like, a, a really good Parasair or something like that that I wanted to tame? And it turns out, oh, I don't have any arrows. I would have been screwed by that point. Maybe this level, I might. This episode, we'll go after the max level spider. You know what? Screw it. Alright, what do we need for the iridescent saddle? Ir. Uh, no, uh, what would it. No, what's it called? Uh. Um, shield. We'll just look up shield. Iridescent chitin saddle. We just need 90 of that chitin and 50 hide. That's all we need. And then I can make the. 
mashed bugs or mashed insects or whatever. So what I might do, go back to base, grab all the resources that I need, and then we'll go after that max level spider. So I guess I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright, so I went ahead and grabbed all the resources, so the max level spider should be somewhere where that orange thing is, that orange ping is. Why does it have to be nightfall? This is the worst time to be in the redwoods because those Trudons, their aggro range is pretty crap during the day, but at night, they've got really good aggro range. I'm talking... I'm talking the greatest aggro range you've ever seen. Are you it? Yep, that's it. That's it. So now what we do is we put the mashed insects onto here. I'm going to take the chitin. we got 59 chitin altogether. I'm going to have you hold on to that. We equip the shield onto ourselves. And I'm just going to put on the ghillie armor just for safe measure. Okay, there we go. I think we're good. I think we're good. Right, come on. And there we have it. Max level 4x spider. Probably tamed it too late, but... Oh, what are you? You're a 20? I'll kill you for your chitin. Alright, so what are we looking at with stats? 35 points into health. 48 points into, into stamina, sorry. Only 27 points into melee. It's got terrible melee. Jesus. Alright. I think we got the spider. So we can go home. I guess check it out. What level are you? You're 15. So I think what you're supposed to do with the spider is that once you get a female, you use the female to tame a male. Because the female, I think, kind of, you know, like, does, like, a mating dance, and then the males find it attractive, and it calms them down, so then you can tame the male. I think that's how you do it. If we could find a high-level male, then that'd be great, but that was relatively easy. It's got terrible melee, though. Alright, so I guess I'll see you guys back at base, where we will test out the spider and see what it's all about. So I guess I'll see you guys in a little bit. Maybe next episode we'll go back into the ocean, see if we can tame ourselves like a, a mated pair of Zephactinus, get like a pack of them, and then we'll be golden. And then we'll see what they, they're capable of, what they can do. And we are back at base. So we're gonna take the Dinosuchus, park you over there. And then from there, we can just... Parasaur, get out the way. Your fault for being in the way. Alright, good job as always. d -arc. I know you didn't really do much, but good job. Alright, let's take a look at this spider. We got like a all white, white and red. That kind of looks cool. Oh, we don't need a saddle to ride it. We are over in comfort, though. Let me go put some stuff away before we take this guy out for a spin. Alright, let's test out the spider if we're light enough. We are. Okay, good. So, the leap. Oh! Uh, game. Game. Okay, good. We do mad hops. Mad Hops. I kind of want to name you Candy Cane, because you're like red and white. I want to see what kind of damage you do. Of course, we're going to see find something small like a Dillo. 157. Yeah, this guy's not meant to be a fighter at all. I don't think he is, anyway. But yeah, we got a cool looking dude. We've got like we got Enable Pounce, which is R. We got Toggle Bite type, which is X. We got Melee and Torpor. Oh, that's cool. So how much Torpor do we do with a bite? 
we just knocked that Pteranodon the hell out. Damn. Okay. You seem to be pretty strong. Let's see how long it takes to knock this Pego out. I don't know what you stole from me, but mind giving it all oh, the bug repellent. Give it back. Thank you. Go ahead and kill you. We don't need a Pego. We really don't need a Pego. Alright. We could do with a lot of we got 3,200 health. Yeah, we're not we're not a fighter by any means. We did knock out that Parasaur in one fight. 157 damage, which is really good. Yeah, trial of do not hit that Bronto by accident. Yeah, we're pretty cool, actually. Release pheromones, which is C. Toggle climbing with right click. Oh, okay. A little bit glitchy. Whatever, let's toggle climbing. Well, that's cool. We can climb the... We can climb the wall. What? Oh, yeah. We sure can. We sure can. Alright. Let's see about this Tyrannodon. Yeah, we just knocked him the hell out. We're really good, actually. Really good. I'd say you're pretty cool. Yeah. Let's do a leap back to base. Oh, God. Okay, I did not want to bounce that way anyway. Let's try to... Pounce back to base. There we go. Perfect. Alright, so we got our little jumping spider dude. Really cool looking. I mean, I'm not too much of a fan of spiders, but this guy, you know what? Pretty cool. Yeah, and by the way, you do have to tame the female in order to tame the male. Just as a heads up. But yeah, we got that. I'm just going to take the spider out to get a screenshot for the thumbnail. You know what? I might just wait for the rain to stop before I do that. But in the meantime, with that, I think that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.